We got the New York Giants, former NFL Hall of Fame, defensive end, Michael Strahan come out, and he called out Skip Bayless, man, and he had to let out his frustration with Skip Bayless getting caught in his lie, lying, saying that nobody had a problem with the tweet. I just did a video covering that, but if you missed it, I'll have a little bit of the clip right here. Here's the video. Twitter, I just tweet, but my boss here at Fox called and said, hey, people are really reacting strongly to your tweet. Maybe you should clarify, which I immediately did. Twitter, I just tweet, but my boss here at Fox called and said, hey, people are really reacting strongly to your tweet. Maybe you should clarify which I immediately did. You're a liar. You're a liar. You know something that you're not telling us, you slimy scumbag liar. Confess, liar, confess. All right, guys, so if y'all want to go check out that full video when Shannon Sharp had exposed Skip Bayless calling him out and saying that the bosses had a problem with the tweet, Skip Bayless denied that nobody had a problem with the tweet. Nobody at the network had a problem with the tweet. Because Skip Bayless was trying to make it seem like he came up there on his own to explain a tweet like he actually had a heart for DeMar Hamlin. You know what I mean? But if you read in between the thin lines, Skip Bayless himself said when Shannon Sharp was like, I wanted you to delete the tweet. I thought you should have deleted the tweet. Skip was like, why would I delete the tweet? I stand on what everything I said. That right there lets you know Skip Bayless had no plans or no intentions talking about that tweet and explaining his tweet. He even said it. I barely checked the feedback on Twitter. I just post things. So that right there goes to show you he wouldn't have even talked about it because he wouldn't have checked what the hell was being said and what was going on. And like I said, I did a video on that covering that. So y'all should go check that out. I'll have the link to that down below in the description box or in the pinned comment section. So with that being said, guys, let's get right into this clip of Michael Strahan calling out Skip Bayless. Here's the video. You know, I've, I've struggled with this in a lot of ways because it's not so much just about, you know, being an athlete and experiencing being on the field and being that close to guys. And then you see something happen to a young man like that. It's just you don't have to be a football player to understand how big this was. And, and you spoke about humanity. And I think but there were things done here by someone here at this network that were inhumane. And, and we sit here and we talk about how good, and I'm sorry to take it this way, but this, this, this route, but I just, I just felt like sensible people and sensible human beings have a heart. And they understand that, that your words and what you say really have an impact, not only uh, on that young man's family. And, 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 and so all the attention should be on this young man, his recovery for yep. sensible people like us here to say that it didn't affect anybody at this network, nobody at this network minded, that's a lie obviously didn't talk to us because it matters to us and it matters to any sensible human being that this young man's life was bigger than any football game. This young man will hopefully be back and forget about football, but just have a life yep. and his family has him. That's the most important thing. And, and I think that was kind of lost Amen a little that. bit in yep. all of this. All right, guys, and that's the end of that clip. And like I was saying, man, for Michael Strahan to come out and call out Skip Bayless, that right there should say a lot because Michael Strahan is not the type of person to just come out and call people out he really is a clean cut media company type of guy you know what i mean we don't see michael strahan in the news like that like how we see everybody else in the news 24 hours a day man so but michael strahan to come out and say what he said that right there goes to show you get bayless man your tweet came off very insensitive so with that being said man get in the comment section down below i would love to hear your thoughts on this like share comment and subscribe and if you're new to the channel comment down new sub if you've been around just say salute and i'll catch you guys on the next video self-taught news and we out man salute peace